Hello everyone, welcome to this mini walkthrough on how to save Soleil, stop him from going hollow, and summon him for the Lord Gwyn final boss fight. Okay, so we're at the Undead Berg. You'll find Soleil just after you defeated the Taurus Demon, or the Taurus uh, Demon. You'll be on the opposite you side hollow. of the bridge where the hell-like dragon is. You'll first off need to speak to him here, otherwise you won't be able to start the quest. Which is fairly obvious, I know, but, um, yeah, so, answer yes to his question, get the white soapstone, and you'll be done for this bit. Oh, aha, so I didn't scare you. I have a proposition, if you have a moment. The way I see it, our fates appear to be intertwined. So what do you see? This please be great. Young. You'll next encounter Soleil in On Orlando, just after the Silver Knight Archers. They say this is optional for the quest, but I would do this just in case. I know you won't be able to summon Soleil in uh, Demon Ruins if you do not talk to him in On Orlando. But as for the quest, I don't know, but I would speak to him here, just to make sure. Oh, there you are. You've been quiet these days. They say this is optional too, but I would do this just to cover your back. So, after you get in the Lord Vessel of Guinevere, go to the Sunlight Altar in the Undead Parish. Just past the Hellkite Dragon, you'll see Soleil at the Sunlight Altar, where you can join as a warrior of sunlight if you meet the requirements for it. Ah. Oh, hello there. Forgive me. I was just pondering about my poor fortune. I did not find my own son, not in Anor Londo, nor in Twilight Black Town. Where else might my son be? Lord Isaac, or the tomb of the Grave Lord? But I cannot give up. I became undead to pursue this. But when I peer at the sun up above, it occurs to me, what if I'd seen as a laughing stock, as a blind fool without reason? Well, I suppose they wouldn't be far off. <laughs> oh, hello there. I will stay behind to gaze at the sun. The sun is a wondrous body, like a magnificent father. If only I could be so grossly incandescent. Right, next up, go to the Door of Chaos. Join the Covenant. Give her 30 humanity so you become a rank plus 2 in that Covenant. I'm aware there's another way of doing this without joining the Covenant, but this is the safer way. After defeating the Centipede Demon, in Demon Ruins, don't go through Lost Isoleth the normal way. Instead, head back to the Chaos Servant shortcut. So the way I'm going in this video, don't head there, don't activate it, otherwise Soleil will go hollow. So right before the Demon Fire Sage boss gate is, turn right, head down the branches, and if you are a Chaos Servant, plus two, you should be able to open the door at the bottom. That'll be the only way you can open the door at the bottom. Shortly, you should notice some chaos bags. Nine of them all together. Eight normal ones, but one red-eyed one, which will drop the sunlight maggot, which won't respawn that bug. That is the one you need to kill. That is the one which will make Soleil hollow, which you can get from this door by just using poison mist or dragon breath, which I'll... Uh, Leave a link in the video for you to watch someone else's video about that. Because we're going to be doing the normal way. But I like to kill all the bugs. Because sometimes this game can be a little bit buggy. <laughs> and if you don't kill all the bugs, you can still go hollow. Even though you've killed the red eye one, which doesn't respawn. So, I, yeah, I would kill all of them. You'll notice the red eye one will give you more souls, so you should be able to spot it. That should be the red eyed one. Yeah, look, he's giving me a ton more souls there. But you can do this either way. If you've already killed the fair lady, the chaos, and you can't join the chaos server, you haven't got the humanity, use the poison mist through the door or the white dragon breath. But if not, this is probably the safer way. The other way may work. 99% of the time, but there is the odd bug which, which it doesn't work. So if you don't want to spot a bug in your game, maybe this is the best way to do it. <laughs> but if you've got no choice, do it the other way. After reaching Lost Isoleth, head back to the shortcut entry. 
where you should see Soleil sitting on the ground. If you don't, try quitting and reloading again after you've reached Lost Isoloth. This should work if you've done everything correctly and you should be there. Once you have the conversation with him or after speaking with him you will be able to summon him for the final boss fight against Lord Gwyn. What now? What should I do? My son. My dear, dear son. I feel so bad for him here. Would He's really, uh, uh, real depressed here, isn't he? Oh, my dear son. My. I thought I'd show you where the summit sign is anyway, just in case. It's at the top of Gwyn's stairs. Just before Gwyn. Yay, we got Soleil for the final bell. Yay. Praise the sun. Alright then, guys. I hope this video has been helpful. Uh, I tried to explain as best as I could. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching, and see you next time.